Halloween Fiend by C.V. Hunt, another one-day read, another horror novella for spooky season. This uh, has some serious uh, fangirl vibes, so to speak. It's kind of uh, Shirley Jackson's Lottery meets um, H.P. Lovecraft. So this is a typical sort of uh, haunted or cursed town. It's cursed with, the, it has the presence of the supernatural entity that uh, needs to be appeased. It's a fairly original and supernatural take on a few other stories that are out there. Yes, this just does channel Shirley Jackson's The Lottery, but more so as a tribute and actually a very good one. Kind of what if somebody turns the tables on that whole fiasco. So uh, one thing it approaches kind of, and it's a bit awkward, is yeah, how do you have kind of these, you know, in this day and age where there's the internet, everything doubles as a camera. I mean, I'm doing this from my smartphone right now. How is it that you have these kind of entities lurking in the town and they go unnoticed? Uh, you know, uh, we've seen some people tackle this. It seems to be through authors, the convention made popular by uh, Stephen King is to simply say that the entity exerts a certain influence within that geographic region, uh, especially in the case of it's an elder entity and it's been there all along. I, you know, I don't know quite how much I buy it. I mean, there are isolated towns within the continuous United States, you know. So it is possible, but it's still very, very unlikely. Uh, nevertheless, there are some points that um, kind of go nowhere with the, with the history of the character's mother. I felt that was a bit of a dead end. Uh, but overall, uh, overall, I feel that, yeah, this book uh, is a great Halloween read. Um, feel free to check it out. Halloween Fiend by Hunt.